Cubs take the field behind right hander Kyle Hendricks fourth start back from the injured list and looking for his first win since coming back Fernando Tatis Junior ready to step in bounce to the third baseman Bryant throw to first in time and the batter is Manuel Margot on the ground again this time Garcia at second the things usually happen when Kyle Hendricks is throwing ground balls. Machado has homered five times in eight games since the break. The 0 1 to the right handed batter lashed on the ground a short backhanded by Baez takes his time throws him out Machado just kind of jogging down the line at first three up three down after a half. Here's Anthony Rizzo with an RBI spot second and third one away Rizzo hits a smash backhand stop by Hosmer shovels to the pitcher on the bag in time as Baez comes in to score Hosmer made a nice play diving toward the line Hosmer shoveled it to Morahone for the three to one put out. But on the play, Baez scores easily. First time through, only one ball hit into the outfield. Here's Tatis. Bouncing ball to Bryant off the hands. Routine play. Bryant charges, picks, throws, gets him. Three up, three down. Bottom of the third inning at Wrigley. one nothing Cubs. Adrian Morejon in his major league debut is out there for a third inning of work. Kyle Hendricks, the pitcher, leads off for the Cubs. Right down the middle at 95 and a called strike. First major league strikeout for Adrian Morejon as he freezes Kyle Hendricks and sets him down on three pitches. So the Padres with back to back two out hits here in the fourth inning against Hendrick have runners on second and third and Francisco Mejia coming up. A swing and a pop fly might be playable shallow left foul territory. Bryant is there he's got it and the inning comes to an end big out. That's the biggest one that Kyle has gotten today. Tying run in scoring position with two gone for Tatis Jr. Line down the right field line a fair ball it'll hit towards the corner around from second base comes Urias and Tatis Jr. drives in the game tying run it's one to one taking the two seamer over the heart of the plate stays inside it and spanks it the opposite way four strikeouts Cal Quantrill here is Anthony Rizzo ex Padre strike three call got him over the inside corner back to back strikeouts for Quantrill five and all Mejia. Switch hitter from the left side in the 1 1 ball game. 3 2 pitch coming. Mejia gets a hanger and hits it well out to deep right field. Hayward looks up and it's into the basket. A home run for Francisco Mejia. Great at bat. Finally got something he could handle and drive. And Hendricks left that pitch up. Mejia deposits it over the right field fence. And the Padres have their first lead of the day 2 to 1 here in the seventh. Galpantro returns to the mound and he has been terrific. And look at his line so far today. So 46 pitches since taking home for Adrian Morihone going three and two thirds two hits no runs he hasn't walked anybody and has struck out five along the way. Robel Garcia first up swung on and sky to center field and deep Margo has room on the warning track waits for it and makes a two handed catch. One out at the bottom of the seventh Jason Hayward coming up here's a swing and a miss as Hayward can't catch up to the 95 mile an hour fastball now six strikeouts for Cal Quantrill and two outs nobody on in the bottom of the seventh. This one is lifted into shallow left. Will had him play shallow comes in makes the catch in a second consecutive one two three inning for Cal Quantrill. So far Quantrill four and two thirds scoreless innings of relief two hits no walks six strikeouts. He has been outstanding. Caratini started yesterday was over three with a walk and a strikeout. He's hitting 267 with four homers and seven doubles. And now another 3 2 to Caratini and a ground ball to the right side. Coming together, Urias has it with Tatis. Throw to first in time. Tatis and Urias came together. It looked like it might be a disaster, but the second baseman made a brilliant play. So two outs and nobody on with Schwarber coming up. The 3 1 to Schwarber is in the air center field. Margo was deep, comes charging in, has time, gets there and makes the catch. What an afternoon for Cal Quantrill. He works a 1 2 3 eighth inning, and to the ninth we go. Load him up again. 3 1 Padres, top of the order, Fernando Tatis. Lions one to right field, and that's going to get in. From third base comes Mejia. Urias is behind him. Two more Padres runs, and the Padres take a 5 1 lead. They have opened it up here in the ninth inning. You said that the Padres need to come up with some timely hits. And that is a timely hit if I ever saw one. Two down, Rizzo at first, and it brings up Garcia. 0 for 3. Kirby comes set with a four run lead and a 2 2. Steve, right three call. This ball game belongs to my San Diego Padres. They can boo the calls, they can boo Carl Edwards. 
It ain't going to change things. The Padres are not swept. They will get a very, very big win against the leaders of the National League Central.